Are you ready to get obnoxious, Gabrielle? Are you ready to get weird, baby? Are you ready to get that energy that the YouTubers need? Come on, baby. Give me that. No, come on, baby. You gotta get, come on, start shaking it. Start shaking it right now. Come on. Gotta start off That's, slow. That is not Wait. nearly what I meant. Shoot. My other what are you shoes doing? untied. My other shoes untied. Oh, all right, guys. We're gonna let her be a nerd back there. But guys, look at this ginormous. I guess it's technically like a normal sized train, but that's the noise. I didn't want you to think that we're having like an earthquake or something. As a kid, I always wanted to be the person that was in the back because I didn't really have to do anything. I could play on like my Nintendo. Um, fun fact. Are you talking about Animal Crossing? No. Oh. Anyways, uh, what do you want to do, Gabrielle? Uh, first off, lock your car. Oh. Anyways, guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack. I'm Jack. Yeah. And guys, guess what? We're vlogging again. Oh my gosh. Who would have thought? Who would have ever thought that a YouTube couple would from vlog. Missouri will be out here vlogging? And not even, you know, honestly, we're not even layered up. We've only got the freaking hottest merch in the game. Oh my gosh. A duck above the titty, what? We're like three frogs, you know what I'm saying? No, I'm just kidding. Nothing will ever replace the rubber duck and merch. But this is a nice little substitute for those of you that already have the rubber duck and merch or want something a little different. It's honestly really nice, very comfortable, and it breathes really well. It also kind of makes my muscles look good. I know, you're looking fine. Maybe I'm it. just being overly you put promotional. It on I don't know. Like, Dang. Should we get pizza, Gabrielle? Be honest with me. All nutrition. Is that what you want? Pizza? Nutrition facts. Of, I don't, I'm just saying. There's so many If you want it, I will here. happily get pizza. I'm just saying. I don't want to be hearing some complaining about how I never do what you I want to do. I honestly don't want pizza. You don't want pizza? Do you want pizza? Yeah, but why you act like I'm like got a gun pointed at no, you? Chill out. No, 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 no. You sound like you want pizza. No, here, film me. This is literally Gabrielle. She's like, I don't know. I mean, do you want pizza? I mean, I'm, I'm sorry. Maybe. I don't. I mean, pizza. I love it. Like, chill out, Gabrielle. My God, I, guys, I promise. I, I put the you revolver you want back. Pizza or not? What? So you don't want pizza or you do? I do want pizza. Okay, so then let's go. No, because you don't want pizza. <laughs> See, anything I have to say is the your, wrong thing. It has to be because of you that we get it, because then I don't feel bad. I feel like I'm just being a good boyfriend. Oh. Whereas if we can I'm the only one that wants it. Out what we want, and then yeah, we, we can burn off a couple pizza. calories and yeah, then refuel those calories with yes. some dis just, just greasy pizza. Sound good? Ooh, sounds great. Knuckle bump Oh it. my gosh, we've already done three knuckle bumps in this video. Guys, there's even more Christmas stuff which I absolutely love and I'm absolutely addicted to. Even though I'm totally against celebrating Christmas or like decorating for Christmas before Thanksgiving. But look at it. You can't not love looking at little Santa Clauses and little Christmas trees. Gabrielle, I'll just get it over for you. I just know that Gabrielle's gonna be begging me to go in here. So honestly, I'm not even gonna make you argue with me. I was about to we'll do just, that. We'll just go in. Yes, let's Is that go good? Yes, Is that what you wanna good. do? Yes. That, do I get a kiss? Do I get another one? Do I get another one? That was, I don't Wait, like that I didn't, I didn't, I didn't like that one. I like more, more passion. There, there you go. go. There you go. It's got to leave a little bit of a mark. You know, I got to be yeah. bruised. I like to be bruised. Oh my gosh. I like to be beaten, Gabrielle. <laughs> Gabrielle brings the whip every once in a while. I'm like, oh god, the handcuffs too. Gabrielle, we definitely. Hold on, I'm struggling right here. We definitely need to get our bling on. Can you imagine vlogging with that around our neck? Oh Everyone would hate Can't us. Hear anything? Exactly. Especially with the way you vlog. Imagine Gabrielle vlogging like this. What's up, guys? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Can you imagine that? No, oh no, my no, gosh. no, no, no. That would just not be It would okay. drive us crazy. Have any of you guys ever watched an interview with a rapper and they have giant chains on and their microphone, like, like who, who's a good, like, uh, like Rich the Kid, every interview, he's got these giant chains right next to his microphone, or like oh, the, uh, the Migos, and so it just annoying. ruins the entire interview. I'm like, I'm trying to learn nothing, absolutely nothing. I've never learned one thing from a rapper, to be honest, but. I would like to listen about their life. Yes. And I can't with all yeah. the bling bling on. Mm -hmm. So Gabby, what I'm saying is we gotta get our bling bling on. So Jack and I are having a debate about this Christmas tree. I like it because it's white and like super colorful, but Jack is too classic and likes the green trees. Gabriel likes to vlog and talk about things but not put them in frame. Alright, that's better. Gabriel, continue arguing with me. See, I like how colorful and bright it is, and it's like white and No, it's when different. you think of a Christmas tree, it's green. It's got some snow on it. Mm -hmm. It's got a little bit of gold, and then it's got red ornaments. But it could maybe be happy green, and bright. maybe gold ornaments. But I mean, this yeah, but that's happy. just not what I think of. Like as a kid, that's okay, not what it was. Okay, but this would be in like a kid's bedroom or something. Maybe. Like I would love that in my room. Maybe as like a nightlight. That's a little bit of an overkill nightlight. Are you, Are you really that afraid me? of Santa Claus? It's really? It's gorgeous. Like if I had a Come daughter, I'd put one of these in her room. Be like, here you go. If I had a daughter, I'd just pick her up and throw her in the tree like a squirrel. That was a joke. Uh, so somehow I accidentally ended up walking into a restaurant and everything is like pink. And uh, uh, I'm gonna leave now and go find my girlfriend because I'm scared. See Gabrielle, this is a Christmas tree. That's what a Christmas tree looks like. When you Google 
Christmas tree. That's typically what's popping up. It's green with a bunch of red and green and maybe gold ornaments, maybe white ornaments. But here's That's the thing, if, you're, if you have like a 10 year old kid, you wanna put something colorful in there. Right? Comments down below, which tree do you prefer? The first one or the second one? Now remember, a lot of people are gonna be biased because everyone likes Gabrielle better. But I'm just saying, that one is very nice. That's a classic look. I'm more of a classy type of guy. You know what I mean? I, that's a total lie, I'm not at all. Oh yeah, you're but, so classy. Yeah, but I could really do without the sarcasm, and especially without the nipple tap. Really? Is that necessary? If you're gonna do it, get more aggressive with it. I want you, I want you to really feel that thing. That's... Okay, we've been dating for four years, I don't even know where my nipple is. Come on, Gabriel, get right here. Where is it? Oh I'm, they're gosh, very far, to, yeah, I know, they're very far to the right and the left, Gabriel. Thank you for putting out my insecurity. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'm going home. <laughs> oh, baby. Hey, Gabriel, Gabriel, I got a game for you. Did you, you just want, almost call me the wrong name? No, of course not, Gabriel. Why would I ever do that? I've, have I ever done that to you? Besides, no. like, mistake you for your twin? No. For, like, the first two years of dating? Alright, anyways, Gabriel, hey, right, let's play a game, alright? Who can get lice first? We try on all the hats. Don't say that. Don't say that. What? Don't say that. Why? Because there's workers around us. What? If, I mean, if they're, I assume they're clean, and if they're mm -hmm. clean, they'll know I'm joking, and it has no effect. If they do have lice, they would get upset. And if they got upset because I called them out, you're slowly walking away from me as if that actually had yep. any effect on anything, Gabriel. Come back here and get in the video. Oh my gosh. What is wrong? I'm with hungry. You? Let's go get food. Oh, so now you want to change the subject? Yes. You want me to scream it louder next time? No. Was that really that big of a deal? If I had a, if I had a store and I had hats. Yes. Common sense. I don't, babe, I don't have that. I know, so then stop talking. Guys, Gabrielle's making me really upset, okay? She's trying to argue with me that this tree ain't even cool. Okay, first the Christmas tree, that's fine. But this one, nah, -uh, that's a beauty. It looks Welcome like, to Missouri. It looks like a yellow apple, like a green apple. What do you mean? That's a beautiful tree, Gabrielle. Wait, let's get in the lighting a little bit better. See? Look at the way the colors reflect. <laughs> That's, when did you become a tree and Gabriel, when did you become a freaking hater? When did you become so argumentative? Whenever you started resorting to trees to get content. I like that tree, Gabrielle. It's gonna be gone in a week. I thought it'd be cool to show people. I know, people. and it's sad. It's sad. What? All these beautiful trees are gonna okay, be gone. Okay, so first I can't talk about lice. Now I can't talk about okay, trees. That was common sense. I was literally about to punch him. The worker was standing right next to us. The worker probably doesn't own the store, probably doesn't care. I know, but And if she does, sense. I'm sorry. You don't talk about lice like, oh, let's see who can get lice first by trying all the hats in this store. Yeah, but most people can talk. I know. <laughs> We're doing food. Be right back with some nice for you. I'm so excited to eat with my baby. Oh my god. I'm so hungry. Eat. It's gonna be so delicious. <laughs> um, no, we're not doing another one. I like it. It's satisfying. It looks good on camera. And it, it keeps the energy up. <laughs> Knuckle bump it. Give me some pa compassion. I want to feel it. No. Oh Wait, my. Hold up, hold up. Why do you like feed off of bringing other people's energy down, Gabrielle? I don't because get it. Because you're weird. Gabrielle, maybe you have lice. Maybe that's why you got so upset. Be that's honest with me. It. Is that why? No. You sure? Yes. Be honest with me, Gabrielle. If I had lice, you would probably have lice. Honesty is the best policy when it comes to dating. <laughs> I'm telling you. Guys, Gabrielle had the audacity to look me in the eyes and go, man, you and me both are breaking out. I'm like, okay, for one, I've got one little pimple right here. And also, point, the, Gabrielle, point at where your pimple is. Right here, I cover it with makeup though. Gabrielle's uh, that definition of breaking out is like one pimple that no one notices. Like, Gabrielle no, 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 is blessed beyond, others. nah. There's a few there others. is not an, another one, Gabrielle. I look at you too much to not notice when there's other pimples. There's not another pimple. You're a darn tootin' liar. No, -uh. see it. That's not true. At if all. I took off my makeup, you'd see one right there, and then like a little tiny one right there, and then there's this one right here. Okay, babe. What? Honestly, whatever. It's, you, that, whatever. My skin is sensitive right now because I'm stressed. So at first, whenever we walked in here, this is like our first time ever being here, and I was like, hmm, I wonder if I'm gonna like it or not. But you know what? My mind has been changed. They have a million, a million, a million. Scratch that. Himalayan salt. So, I mean, you gotta like it, am I right? Yeah, I love chameleon salt. I said, him I don't even know what I just wow, said. Wow, really pretty. Oh. We've been here for a long time waiting for this. Because I've been trying to get my jacket off. Yeah, yes. guys, I just want to take a moment to say that we appreciate you. I know that's a really generic thing for a YouTuber to say. I know everyone says it, but like, we really do. Um, this year has just been incredible for us. It's not even over yet. As a matter of fact, it's about to get even busier now that we have our uploading schedule and everything. You know what, I'm gonna turn, I'm gonna roll up our windows so this isn't incredibly loud. But I just wanted to like remind you guys of how much you mean to us. Yes. 
I've wanted to be a YouTuber for literally 10 years since I was in fifth grade. And I just, I just think that's so, that's so weird. That's so weird. Like to just even think of, but it's true. And I never thought I'd be at this level. And especially with like the girl of my dreams. Like I never, you know, like when you think of like what you want to do with your life, you typically, you typically have this like, like incredible version and you have like a practical version and you always know in the back of your head that the practical version is the real version or like the possible one. I, I would have never thought that we'd be able to do this together I would have never or I'd have a either. girl like this or like, like when I was in fifth grade or like even in middle school, early high school, I was just not, I wasn't very like secure with myself. I was not the same. I wasn't out. I wasn't out there. I was very kept. I was very scared. And it's just, I like when I go back and I look at like pictures, like yearbooks, I was doing this the other day and I'm just like, I, I wonder what, like what I would have said to myself or like told myself. I feel if like I could we've go both back. changed so much. Like even just from the time that we started doing YouTube to where we are at now. Definitely. Like you guys have changed us for the better. And I know that might sound corny, but like it's because of you guys that I feel like we're better versions of ourselves because you, you guys, guys pushed us. You to do the unthinkable. You guys definitely kept us together too. Yeah, you guys were Like, really I'm not saying like we wouldn't have stayed together. We probably would have stayed together anyways, but like mm -hmm. just knowing that we like had this audience and we like had this job that we love. The fact that we have people supporting us. Yeah, like that are there for us, always like, like just supporting us in whatever we do. That like kept us together, like through hardships, through, you know, all these different things that we had to go through. Like, uh, because obviously we've been together for so long. Like obviously we've yeah, been, through, we've been through life together. Like, exactly. Like, I don't even know what life would be like without her. And I can't even imagine what life would be out without her and YouTube. The only thing I ever put in before YouTube is her. So it's always Gabrielle and then YouTube's like a pretty close And then everything else. And then everything <laughs> else is just like way down here. Besides Call of Duty. Call of Duty oh sometimes, it depends on the year, but. You know what I'm saying, but you you guys have given us opportunities and just a life that we I never thought would be yeah. possible. And it's so bizarre because right now we're in it mm -hmm. and I feel totally and normal. Here's the thing. I don't feel it, guys. I just I feel like I don't even like like it's not I don't even remember like I do YouTube. You're just kind of like mm, okay, <laughs> time to start my day. I'm going to vlog a little bit. But what's crazy is you guys are the ones who've like I don't even know how to say this. Like, we're gonna be telling stories to our kids about you guys. We're gonna be like, oh my gosh, remember this one time that we got sent like this? Or remember how we met them in the mall? Like, it's that type of stuff. That's absolutely crazy. Like, we're gonna be talking about this like for the rest of our lives. So, I don't know. I was gonna make a really good point, but Gabrielle butted into me so aggressively that I totally forgot it. That sucks. I had a really good thing to say. Look what you did. I'm sorry. I do it all Gabrielle the Gabrielle looked guilty. Did you see that face Gabrielle just I made? know, because it was Gabrielle was really like. Good. Oh no. <laughs> Anyways, we really appreciate you guys. Like we honestly love you guys. You guys are like our family. Like you you like you know, I, it, it's so weird to me because I I like to think that I'm like a genuine person. I don't like the corny stuff. I don't like lying. I the only like lying that I do is clickbait and I don't feel bad about that at all. But I just like I I can't tell you guys enough. Like it, 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 it sounds weird for me. It's weird for me to say it, but it's true. Like we love you guys. Like you guys are, like, are our family. Like we feel like we want to be good role models. We want to help you get through your day, entertain mm -hmm. you, make you happy, you know, make you feel like you're a part of something because you are. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I never thought I'd be able to say that. It's just weird. It's just so weird. We're so lucky. There's so much. I don't believe in luck, though. I think we did it for ourselves. I'm very proud of us. Mm -hmm. But I think we are fortunate. I like the word fortunate. I don't like the word luck. There's no such thing as luck. You're right. Gabrielle's lucky though. If I'm being totally honest, I have a guy like me. I was gonna say you're the most lucky person I know. How? Because everything for Jack, I don't know how. Everything always goes right for Jack. That's because I make it happen. <laughs> I know. And almost everything goes wrong. It just would appear that it goes right everything because I make it my problem and only my problem. And yeah. then I fix it. Mm -hmm. Like this merch, the No Limits merch was the biggest problem I've ever <sighs> had to deal started. with, guys. I can't even begin to talk about how big of a pain it was to actually have these things How made. stressful it was too. Absolutely Going ridiculous. back and forth and back and forth. But I'm glad that they're out. I'm also glad that these are out. These are fire. Like, I love these We ones. waited so long for these to be like actually sent to us and made. 
And the fact that, like, I know it's a simple design, but it wasn't, it wasn't simple to make. We went through all these different designs, but I like this. This is like, it's very clean. It looks almost like streetwear. Like, you can wear this. Like, you can wear that. But, like, it looks good. Like, even someone that doesn't understand what it is, like, they're not gonna mention, like, you're not, you're not gonna have anyone, like, what's on your shirt type thing, you know what yeah. I'm saying? It's so. like, oh, that's cool. Yeah. And it I'm, matches everything, too, because there's so many colors in it. It really does. That's what I love about it. But we are going to go film another video. Yes. I'm yeah. sure, because we have to go back and take thumbnails for the videos that go up yes. today. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, once again, we, you guys, you guys have, you like, guys you guys are awesome. Amazing. Um, we'll be, eventually we'll be better with our vocabulary and be better at explaining it, but... <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed. If you're interested, all the merch is down below. The Rubber Duckin' merch, the No Limits, this merch is all down below, as well as our packages, and they are on sale now. So hope you guys enjoyed it, and we will see you in the next one.